A C B A. Yes, sir. We're officially back at it. Book nice coming at you with a quick daily update. So, and I can't wait for the rest of the ACBA community to get their hands on this and take their own shots of the engine of vengeance. So, Absolutely. and we love you guys too. Much love to Dan, Dwight, Ryan. So yeah, a few hours ago, Hasbro wrapped up their 1027 live stream event. Obviously they have reveals for all of their major brands, but I just want to focus on Marvel Legends real quick. I will say this though, that the G.I. Joe classified series Serpentor went back up for pre-order. I had missed that initially. I was able to pre-order that. But yeah, we know the engine of vengeance is down bad after a brief talk about the 3.75 inch Marvel Legends line and a Power Man reveal. They did talk about the EOV really trying to sell it with the light up features. I must say it does look really, really cool in the low light with the LEDs shining real bright. You know, they really trying to entice the toy photographers, the ACBA community. I get it. I smell you. But we are down to the wire here. And, and is this package now that we've seen the final tier that they revealed here today worth 350 bucks. I'm hearing a resounding no from a lot of people out there. Listen, man, I'm still on board. I'd love to get this car. I would have loved to get the full power down Robbie and I definitely want Mephisto. But I was chatting with my man, David Walton, and he mentioned how it's pretty much a travesty that they didn't go all out with the accessories on the tiered figures. Mephisto should have had a throne. Goblin Queen should have came with a few little goblins. And the son of Satan should have came with some fire effects at least. So they're doing the bare minimum and doing the most at the same time. Man, I, I do hope that this gets funded, but I mean, we definitely going to have to talk about the corporate side of things with Hasbro and really take a deep dive into that on this week's episode of the Articulated Comic Book Art Podcast. But yeah, a couple other reveals. They showed Smoking Jacket Wonder Man, which is definitely one I had on a short list that I wanted to see made. He's going to be part of a Build-A-Figure wave. We don't know who that Build-A-Figure is going to be, what character it'll be. My man David Walton says his bet is on Super Adaptoid. I could see that. Finally, we're going to get a new Baron Von Strucker. But is he really new? Is this the Bucky Cap mold that I see? I really like the head sculpt. I like the way the, the claw looks. Should have probably got some different sculpts for that hand, though. And apparently they're going to be matching him up or pairing him up with some other characters that we'll find out about next year. Maybe that's that Army Builder 2-pack they talked about. And maybe I was wrong about it possibly being a Kree 2-pack and it'll be another Hydra 2-pack of some sort. I don't know. They also showed off the Yelena Belova figure here, which I had a custom of her in this getup many, many years ago. I think I still have it, actually. But yeah, this is when she was kind of running around with the Thunderbolts. And then they also showed off the first two pack from the Spider-Man animated series line that's coming out next year. So Carnage and his Spider-Man animated series-esque colorway deco. And we're going to get a fully articulated black suit Spider-Man with the toe joints as well. So they did talk about a lot of these two packs coming out next year from the Spider-Man animated series imprint, the VHS sort of offerings, and we'll have to stay tuned for more. They were in and out. Again, we'll talk about all of this stuff in depth on the podcast this coming Friday. The Engine of Vengeance is going to be wrapping up on Monday, October 31st, which is also the last day of October. So I hope you guys keeping up with that. And yeah, I got to process all of this. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out. As always, rate, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell down there. And until next time, peace. I'm in the game. I'm grinding. I got the play. 24 hours in the day, seven days out the week. I never sleep. I'm on my grizzly bear, 52 weeks out the year. 